Hello everybody, my name is Trollmaker, and this is the Wargame Red Dragon campaign, Bear vs. Dragon. Now there was one miss here, unfortunately, I did a 40 minute video, which unfortunately didn't turn out for some reason or the other. And so there's two battles that happened here that, you know, missed, and one was a win, one was a loss. Uh, so the computer is looking much, much smaller than before. I was also able to trap this guy here. Note he has no retreat path, so when I do this naval sector Charlie, he will have nowhere to go. But for now we have this Nahadka battle, and uh, these have not been going well. Uh, the groups are kind of split up funny, but this time it looks like I'm getting everybody. So this should go pretty well, but he's also getting everyone. Note he has SC-25, IL-102, MiG-29S, and he has six T-80As. So this is a very brutal battle. Now I do have my two points, Delta and Bolshul Kaman. Bolshul Cayman. I like the Cayman Islands, so we'll get the fight this one out. And... Uh, Hopefully I win. Really, I'm hoping this battle is a- Oh my god, I got Charlie too. How did I get Charlie? Okay, that's a huge victory for me. Okay, and um, yeah, so that means I get to get, keep this little town here with like eight infantry. That's crazy good. And oh my god, this town too with like one... Who? What? Oh, that's right. It's all. Oops, that's wrong one. Um. Right. So I only get. Hmm. Priorities. Priorities. What should I go for? Bravo or Kava? Let's go. Those are funny names. So we're gonna get a. Uh... The problem with the tanks is that they they start off kind of funky. Um. Notice the positioning it means they'll get side shots. So I'm going to put them in the woods here for now, I think. And try to use them in sort of a flanking type position. Uh, but I will be able to use these PGZs, which are pretty crazy good. And now it's the. Uh, Jellum's pretty decent. Uh, do I have an FOB? I do. We'll be placing that uh, right here. Now I do need to have something covering this area, uh, just something small. So maybe a few more tanks here. Recon, let's get a helicopter. Why not? Now I do need a lot of air superiority and I only have this one left. Ooh, that's brutal. That is not good at all. Uh, this is an auto cannon. I can use him. PGZ-63, pretty damn cheap. Ah, uh, what else do I need? So here's the madness of my plan. I'm just gonna have a few of these guys here. And yeah, a few more tanks will do. Okay, so this has to be timed out pretty well. So we're gonna launch and I gotta like evacuate these guys right away. Shazam then. And that will do some good stuff here. Okay. So madness of the plan. I need to get these guys firing on um, where the majority of their forces will be, which is right there, I guess. Ooh, there's a command on the move. A command on the move. He's gonna pass by this road. Oh, BTR 60 PBs cannot stand up to my tanks. Not a chance. You found my rocket artillery on where I think most units are. There's a T-80A right there. That's going to be a, a very, very tough target to kill. Uh, we're good on the troop count. We have KA-29 TB. These guys are nasty. I'm going to try and pick it off with all these airplanes. I don't know if I will be able to. The computer plays quite randomly with his targets. I'm not going to lie about that. Oh wait, he has air subs and going pretty good. Oh god, MiG-29S is out. I got Strellas, I can bring them out. PGZ-80 is firing on it. Oh, that's a few hit points, good. This KA-29TB uh, is so freaking good. Oh god, the IL-102, oh no, 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 no. He cannot do the damages. I got a stun on him, that's crazy, I can get, I can get him. Stun, oh, he backed, oh shoot. Here's a Tunguska moving forward, right into my tanks. Come on, Beast Grill, excellent. God, one hit point left on him. That's it, okay. Uh, I don't have much for anti-air. I have to use these Estrellas. Uh, I need to get more tanks up. Way more tanks. No, you go over right here. Uh, let's see. 
This guy's moving, and... Whoa, this guy is out in the open. I don't want that. Oh good, this K29 TP is finally going to die. There's a Tungus guy. I can kill that pretty easily. With these Deuteronomies. Look, this guy's not even in a building right now. And it's got a command kill. The more command kills I get, the better. Command kills are very, very good right now. And these T-88s are just going to rush through my infantry doubles, but not before I take it a lot of them. Note the uh, morale right now is usually in my favor. If uh, MiG-29's out, I bet the IL's coming soon, too. Seems to be how he plays. Let's see if he got that way. It could, it's hard to say. Alright, BM got some pretty decent hits there. If you... No, he actually didn't follow up. I guess it took too much damage before. Okay, um... Very interesting. Oh my god, it's a Tor! The Tor doing it out in the open. Getting killed is what's getting happening to a dear god. Okay, <laughs> got a 80 point kill there. That's sickly. Um, surviving, that would be something else. Right now, it's not looking too good. The T88 is just so freaking good. I got a lot of them to kill. Uh, I don't want to do the strafing run, but I might have to. And I'm actually out of infantry. This guy's got to pull back. Way fast. Okay, that's not happening. Can't even see him. Okay, and we have a tank coming up. I'm going to have to move him here to more of a defensive position. These T-88s are just nasty. And BTRs, not- this guy will do something. Um, put him like right here. And here come some helicopters, and I have units in the area to deal with this. What else can I put out here? We found the helicopters, not going to be useful. The M21s, they will be useful. I don't know where to use these two though. That's my problem. There's a tour there, I don't want to go for that, that's bad. Cannot go for the tour. Uh, yeah, I need to get more artillery types. PLZ-70 would be good, let's get a lot of those. Now we got an anti-tank in position, sort of, kind of. Now, what else can we put out here? Um, T-55s, they won't do too much. We can put them over here. Uh, the whole army sort of falling apart right now, unfortunately. Now let's get this tour killed. Oh my god, 130 point kill there, that's disgusting. And these seem to be in a decent area. Uh, I feel good about all these BMP2s from the side shots here. Estrella needs supplies. Can I get them past the T, uh, the T-80As I wonder? Question of the moment. I'm gonna put it, uh, maybe right here. That's where his, uh, attack path or defensive path or some sort of pathing comes through. Okay, so these guys need to be firing on... I think this sector. Let's see these guys. Dear God, the, the carnage. No, I'm not gonna be able to get anything past these T-88s. That's not happening. I just really wish he'd come out more in the open. Oh well. Uh, Moto Stratokies are trying to rush in. I need mortars. For those infantry. Okay, BM21 can go restock. And oh, this will be if I can get this time's right. I don't know if uh, it will. Like, no, it doesn't appear so. Um, let's fire right here. Seems like a decent enough spot. And you can randomly fire the same area. Not on my infantry units. Ah, shoot. 
Oh my god, he's got 85 points worth of kills there? Oh, the IL-102 ran away. That's what's happening. Okay. Um, so, what do we can use? These guys I can use because they have... No, wrong one. Wrong one. I need this one. I can use these guys because they have a vehicle with AT on it. So I can get the uh, anti-air infantry and the AT all kind of in one. And it looks like these guys will in fact be able to get over here and deploy some anti-air options, which is excellent. God, just burning through these this FOB like crazy. I'm just gonna keep spamming here because that's just a sick area to attack. Now, can I use a recon helicopter to find targets for my tube type artillery? Tube type artillery are very very strong, but require a spotter. Which makes them uh, kind of problematic. This is T062s. Oh, hello, super flamethrower tank. Let's see what you can do through here. Oh, these guys are not doing so hot. Okay, we're gonna keep one there. Actually, both can supply from that same area. Great. I might be able to knock out those T062s before they can do any damage to my infantry numbers, which is my primary concern right now. Okay, uh, let's get more splash over here. Now, once they get that napalm rolling, I gotta, I gotta move my units. Napalm just way too strong. They also have a cannon on them, which makes them a very, very fierce uh, opponent to deal with. And looks like they wiped out one of my tanky types. I think it's just an IFB, but it's a tanky type. And it looks like they're gonna still roll down some units over here. So I'm down, but I'm not out. Ah, oh, it's Books. I wish I could kill those. I'll look at the points. The computer's bit to collapse. It's all in the points. This artillery is just too damn good. And lots of support type units. Okay, so we have our first target of value, the Beriusa. Gotta die. We're also gonna redirect one of these guys to corrected shot there. Oh, T-80As. Oh boy. T-80As. Okay. Now I'm gonna get these guys in position is. Ooh, he's hit my strellas, that's not good. Oh boy, got all my strellas. Yikes. Let's see, what else can I get? Feel these 70s, more of these guys. Let's see if I can correct the shop at uh, TO62s with just a ridiculous amount of artillery. And we'll go check to see if I killed that unit. If I didn't, I am mostly screwed. Looks like the very use of was able to escape in time. Um, so you can find a more prominent secondary target. Uh, we can get these KA-29 TBs. I think I'll let him... Yeah, there we go. That's some good shooting. Got right on the target I needed to. Oh boy. Let's see if the IL follows up. The IL almost always follows up. In the meantime, I just gun around this TO-62. As my girlfriend laughs in the background. Probably at a dog or something. Oh, these books are so friggin' strong. Don't kill anything. You got one. You got one. Well, my artillery's doing pretty good too. Uh, probably paid off that attack in a little bit. So now I got all these, these extra supplies. We're just gonna bring them over here and directly use them to attack him with. Okay, mortar, time for you to do your job. Mortars are close range units. Okay, I'm actually double the score right now. That's crazy. I can 
probably squeeze a win out of this. Which I would have never thought possible in the past. But now I question everything. Oh, that's crazy close range. Um, like, right there. I got all the TO-64s gone. I can fire on this helicopter, and yes, you can artillery helicopters. That's totally within the realm of game logic. Hmm, all I can get. It's all getting those air subs. It looks like uh, I will hit my target, but unfortunately, these are pretty heavily armored tanks. And Wow, they're actually surprisingly doing a lot of damage here. Look at this. They're going crazy on morale damage. They're taking small bits of damage, and now they're about to run into my infantry. What is happening? Stunned. Oh my gosh. Who's running low on T-80As? You can't afford to engage my infantry right now. Oh, this guy shouldn't be moving. Okay, so I got a round of volleys over here. What if I kill that helicopter off? Oh god, the supply trucks. Oh, we got both his jets up. That bastard. There goes all my infantry numbers, by the way. All gonzo. I think I killed that helicopter off. Interestingly enough. So we can get that helicopter now. The only downside is that I don't really have the kind of units I would want. And it looks like I've got a 15 point kill, so that's a, probably a, a. what we call them. Uh, that's probably a, a supply vehicle of some sort. So I've cut down his T88 numbers quite a bit. Uh, not enough though, not for what I want. Back. Oh my. He's got it in the range of all my units here. I gotta get them out of there. This tank has gotta come in to cover this position here. I burn through all the all, all of his supply trucks. Now let's keep pushing forward. Let's see if we can find more stuff here. More stuff to kill with our recon. So I'll put the shot and the swap. I just don't know where to fire. My memory's not that good. Once I get his command uh, on Bravo, if I kill it, that's huge. Like, I'm set back on Charlie, which is bad. But if I set him back on Bravo, then I'm golden. It means I only have one flank to worry about, which will be this one here. Oh my god, look at this long range Tunguska I can kill. Oh god, Conquers! And, and Mitilib Strela. But the, the Tunguska kill will be worth. Losing all this. Over. Uh, I can get another recon helicopter, actually. I got lots of money, actually. And lots of lots of artillery units. Dear God. Gotta resupply them all. I don't understand why my mouse always just instinctively drives that direction. Okay, things have to push back a bit. The T-80 ball is coming. And we're scared of the T-80 ball. It's very scary. Hopefully I kill that Tunguska. Oh, it looks like I have. So this is where the Strella was located, around that area. I'm gonna try and gun around that T-88, just down to its last little bit of hit points. If I kill it, that's great. If I don't, probably no real loss. Oh, never mind. Here's some books right here. Oh god, I lost one. So that was a real loss. I lied. Oops. Okay, running out of units, running out of steam. It's done right there, please. You, you do not get to do anything. I don't have any more recon options. So this is my last helicopter, my last recon helicopter that I can possibly use. He's Gonna try and go in right here, Lois. To me. Let's see if I can aim this right. God, look at this crazy stream of uh, traffic here. 
I want to get rid of these supply trucks so he doesn't uh, resupply his um, his Deuteronomies, his um, his T fifty five or T eighty A's because they're just they're brutal enough as is. Um, more cargoes because we're needing a lot more artillery. We're kind of playing a cat and mouse type game here uh, for now. So I'm just steadily streaming this position where I believe he might target. And I can get some flanking shots in this T-88s, and that would be destructive. I think these are the uh, supply trucks. Should be highly vulnerable. My chili fire anyway. And I'm just going to keep streaming uh, resupplies here, because these guys are chewing through my supplies like crazy. I don't exactly know where his tanks are. I probably should be using this recon helicopter for that. Um, haven't seen his. Haven't seen his actual, you know, real units in a while. His planes and whatnot. I wonder if they're dead. Oh, here's some tanks. Here's some tanks. Now we're talking, he's cutting through my BMs. So you got, oh, gotta get these guys out of here. Oh, he's flying right over my man pads. Look at this, look at this. And here's the Strellas loading up, MiG-29, gonna go down. Down, and IL could also go down here. Will he evac it? I don't know. Mine, are out of there, and I got, I got another T-80A kill. Oh god, yes, but the other one, the other two are kind of problematic right now. It's all these flanking shots I've been doing with this dude. So I can move this guy as far over here as possible. Now, do I have any more BM-21s? I do. Uh, in a pretty wide area. Try to get a stun off. Okay, now this is where I make my money. I got 400 more points for a total victory. And that's not a lot of points. Let's see if we can wrestle some tigers. But I gotta find these things, that's the big hindrance. Oh, there they are. I think they're gonna sit in position until they get resupplied. Which is excellent for us right now. Probably move these guys up to northern flank too now. That only seems to have a small, small, small smidgen of forces in. Just not give me enough time. Artillery fire is off. If we can kill one, that's great. If we can't, nope, not happening. Dear God, that was a long battle. Alright, a draw. He lost his air recon. I lost my air recon. He lost. He has how many T-80As left? Four total. Jesus. But I don't have that many forces left myself. So that's brutal. So I might have to actually... Uh, Refitting. Whoa! Uh, look at that, he lost two uh, Koi's apparently. I lost one. That wasn't in the stats. So he has one, two, three, four, five, six Koi's left. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight Koi's left. Now there is this other battle here, and I just kind of want to see if the computer will play it. Or whether he'll retreat. So he's going to have to do this battle. This is given. So we'll play that one out. Uh, yeah, that's how we left it. And he's running into squadrons, so very soon I should be able to punch him in the face, but it is turn 16, so I gotta do it very, very soon. Very soon, big punch in face. Big punch in pie. So, um, I don't have a lot of planes left, that's kind of a problem. Specifically because he has a lot of uh, air coins. I don't have a lot of Shkrellas left, also a problem. But I do have these guys. Actually, I might get these guys instead. Yeah, I like them better because they have uh, anti-tank uh, types. And I don't have to really worry about that flank too much. I'll be staging like a couple of tanks here or something. Maybe right here. And maybe a flamethrower tank for front of these. Flamethrower tank over here and here. Here I'm capped out on. Tanks I'm capped out on. Uh, yeah, what I have meant for me right now is going to be artillery, so we're going to put down like a couple more FOBs and 
We're gonna do a lot of artillery now. These are on the legs. Kinda like them. Ooh, wait, I need to recon unit. I don't have any recon units left? What world am I living in? Okay, um... Okay, my dog is barking. Probably because I'm abusing him secretly. Okay, so I have no recon unit, but I have <laughs> artillery. So this is going to be kind of weird. I'm going to have to start spamming right off the beginning. And I might have to have a sacrificial TLB5. Sorry, Mom. I'm going to bring up this path. See if I can get him to sneak in here. Get it a little bit of vision. They don't have the best vision, so it's not going to be anything crazy. Um... Hmm. Let's try and split up these guys a little bit. A little more territory. And I still have like a lot of T fifty or T eighty A's to worry about. They're still very threatening. So let's see if I can get any random kills. Oh Speak of the Devil. He's here already. Did not take him long at all. I gotta resupply this front hardcore uh, some supply vehicles. They gotta sit in position too. So they got one kill. That'll do. Okay, back to normal speed. Try and stay off the road. I wanna go. Actually, no, I can go in the woods here and be sneaky. So turn off my weapons for now. Just because I'm using this unit as a as a unit that it's not. It's not a, a recon unit. I, he only has. Oh my god, he doesn't have enough commands to get brought up. I wonder if I can just come in here and snipe up command. Will that do it? Oh, that sounds interesting. And now that I think about it, oh my god, here comes some more units. Please don't be T T-80As. That would be ridiculously brutal to deal with. Okay. Uh, 35 points. What would that be? Uh, what well, it would be a 35 point vehicle. Um, the BW, no, that's a 10. This could be a BMP3. I think. But I'll never know because it's about to die. Yeah, it's definitely. Oh, TO62, actually. Interesting. And apparently, I also killed an infantry squad. So we'll fire them here or somewhere. I don't know. Just gonna start spamming artilleries because that is what will work right now. Cause he doesn't have a lot of uh, units, and this is gonna be very anticlimactic. Oh my god, he has another command. Okay. Um, the fact that he has another command means that I can potentially spot it, but it also means he has forces coming down this direction, potentially. So that's kind of scary. A little bit more kind of scary, actually. So, I'm, uh, just in case you're wondering why am I hitting here, this is a crossroads. This is every single unit that rallies in has to go through here. So, and it's the best possible guess that you can make. So that's why all my units will be artillery in this location until I find something of value to kill. And 255, you need to find something to kill for all my artillery, because that's all I have. Artillery. Okay, uh, let's slow this down. I'm gonna get this dude over here to watch a slow-mo battle. This is very exciting. all cinematic and slow motion and stuff. Alright, let's see what we can pick off. Um, if I get a command kill here, that's like game ending for the computer, not for me. Um, more of Zs, because these will be our champions. Champions of the throne. And TO55 getting through very easily, not finding a single opposition yet. I meet, probably means there's actually no units there. I'm just going to move my artillery location just to uh, so that no stray artillery accidentally hits my 255. Which is now burning on. 
as my computer is slowing down a bit. Probably doesn't like me recording this long of a session, but today we're doing that. Okay, now this is where it gets kind of dangerous. I'm moving out in the open. Uh, there could be a lot of stuff around here. Like, I don't even know what kind of... Uh, I don't even know what kind of units he's sitting with here. Which is the scary part of it all. Okay, so I'm out in the open. No more hits, no grits. Oh, TADA. Don't kill, please. Don't kill. Turning off weapons just so I become more invisible. Get in there. Get inside. Okay, lost vision, which means he's probably lost vision, which means that I'm back to being golden. And I also grabbed a location to do all my artillery at. Yes, I'm going to try and artillery down a T-80A. Tell me how pointless it is. Go ahead, tell me how pointless it is. I will not listen, because I know it's pointless. T-80As are very, very hard to kill. If I killed one with artillery, that would be amazing. It's not much of a choice. It's the only unit I have left, is the artillery unit. And my BMs are coming to restock. Looks like I uh, touched a nerve there, potentially. I might be near his command unit. Hmm. Yes, I have to be near it somewhere. It must be up here. Where would he run his command unit to? Okay, this TO-55, we're going to get busy. We're going to use him as a spotter, too. Now, I don't think the optics on these guys are actually very good. Uh, optics, bad, yeah. So they'll have to be right on top of the units in order to actually spot them. TADA was kind of a lucky grab. Whew. Oh, I got some uh, supply vehicle kills. Excellent. It's kind of the best I could have asked, asked for there. I almost said hasked. Adding a H on to your asking. Okay, and BMs are good to go again. Hmm. Where could this command be? Maybe it's command infantry. Ooh. Changes everything. Yeah, this computer's running massively out of steam. I'm falling pretty far behind, but so is he. And I will take advantage of that because he didn't have artillery and I do. I don't even know what to do with these mortars anymore. The battlefield is not um, really set for mortars. This TO-55, unfortunately, is like the worst spotter in the world. Do I have any other units with better optics? What are, what are these? Poor? <coughs> Good. That's air detection. Um, yeah, I have like no real units here for spotting. That makes for a very brutal battle. I'm assuming the computer will place uh, on the northern half here. But I could be wrong. Oh, what's this command? Two commands? That can't be right. 50 point kill, whatever it was, must be anti air unit. There's something coming along here. I am going to napalm this area here. Now oh, that's a very fast napalm. Okay, I got some pretty good kills there, I think. Well, momentarily I'll have very good kills there. He can't seem to rally any new units in. So I must be doing pretty good. Probably this tank up now. Oh dear lord. Part of this vehicle is it's stunned. Even a simple T-055 can kill that. 15 point vehicle kill. Hmm. Could be a supply truck. Could be a, a, a BTR PB. That's roughly that cost. Yeah, 
outrageous amount of artillery is part of this scenario. For the computer, not for me. I'm supposed to have very, very little artillery. Now if I can just find this command, I could win this. Put an end to this game. So I don't have much longer to actually uh, beat this. Eventually I go kaboot. And it's all over. Uh, what have we found here? A cargo. And I've stolen both of them. Excellent. I will use those supplies with great happiness. As, whoa, T-80A right here still? Hmm. And Bomber came in and killed his own supply trucks. What a nasty boy. I think I just lost the T-55 or something. Sad. Probably my own artillery fire, perhaps. That sounds like a pretty uh, convenient loss. Uh, looks like I might not be able to do it this turn, unfortunately. The computer is just uh, hiding his commands very, very well. But if I can get rid of some of these uh, tanks, I, I'll be doing very, very well. Oh my god, I just got one of them. At least one of them. Oh Jesus, there's something here. What is it firing from? Right here. MiG-29 is dropped a bomb. Will it hit my T-55? I don't think so. Oh boy. Run, boys. Run. Whatever this is, is dangerous. Okay, so all my T-55s are officially dead. Um, I'm still getting more points. My computer cannot be aggressive, but I've lost a lot of units. There's no time. Okay, let's speed this up a bit. Let's kick some butt. Alright, still get more artillery out. There's a nice corrected shot. Maybe I've got to go up here to resupply. You're out. Time for you to move. The computer's going to have to retreat eventually. We can't withhold all this damages for very long. Um, I must have killed something by now. Probably move on to this target here, the T-80As, which I killed one with artillery, that's crazy. So crazy, it just about worked. Yeah, this computer just can't deploy anything anymore. I don't feel particularly threatened anymore. Uh, I don't really like using these vehicles because they can die so easily. Given the current situation, I can probably get away with it just because I have so much freaking artillery. Okay, back down to normal. Oh my god, there's something in here. It's a book. It's a book. Double book. Those are just easy kills with the air. Mm, easy kills. Oh wow, something actually killed there. Not good. Okay, so if I can kill a command off, I'll be set for my next battle. That is, if I have time for my next battle. God, 
this rain of fire. And these guys can't actually make it, so I'll probably get them some cargo over here. Actually, a lot of cargo, so I have a lot of cargo to give. Did I kill those boots yet, I wonder? It would be just nice to know. God, this is just so much damage. The computer doesn't know how to respond. Like, he doesn't realize, like, I don't have anything. I really don't. Pretty damn broke as far as units go. My Apple Bs are getting drained too. <laughs> but it was totally worth it. funny because I drained two FOBs, so a lot of these units that are near other FOBs are not really in range. So let's get this cargo back. He's already the damage he needs to do, and that will do it. I draw again, I believe. Yeah, draw. Uh, but the computer's been lost his VDVs, he has no he's lost a lot. He's hurting. Now I only have one more turn to get to this location, and next video I get to do this battle, which is one that I forced on the computer. See you guys then.